Hello everyone, I welcome you all to my another video session wherein we will be discussing about how to migrate bots from previous version to the latest version. That is, in this video you will be seeing that how we will migrate our bots from version 11 to automation 360 format. So before we start our session for the day, I request every one of you to please subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit the notification icon so that you receive all the latest updates and notifications that we keep posting on our YouTube channel. So without any further delay, let us start our session for the day. So let us start our discussion on bot migration. So first of all, we will discuss what is bot migration. Bot migration enables you to migrate bots from version 10 or version 11 to A360 format. It also helps you to convert enterprise 10, 11, 360 bots that uses Internet Explorer to Microsoft Edge with IE mode. So this action can be done. So this step can be done using the update uh, update bots command or update bot action present under the bot migration package. So we will see each of the actions one by one in detail uh, using 8 2019 automation anywhere. So let us move to the uh, community edition uh, where we will be uh, where we will be uh, migrating bots from version 11 to uh, A360 format. So from the bot migration package, drag and drop the migrate legacy bot action and select the desktop file and select the file which is present in your required directory. It can be either on the uh, local machine or from the control room also you can select. So here my file is present in the local directory. So I will select the desktop file tab. Click on the browse button. And select the version 11 bot from your local uh, directory. So after selecting the bot. Uh, in the output folder path field, select the uh, path where you want to uh, where you want to uh, get the output or the XML file uh, which will be generated after the bot is migrated. And if the file is already exist, so you have to check this override the file if exist check bots. So now we will uh, click on the save button. And if in your bot, uh, this uh, if, and if in your bot, uh, Internet Explorer browser is used, so you can also check this convert bots built using Internet Explorer to Edge with Internet Explorer mode chat bots. And if Internet Explorer is not used, so you can leave this chat bots as it is. So now we will run the bot to see what will happen. So once you click on the run button, the bot will be deployed on the system on which you are running the uh, bot and the bot uh, and the bot dependencies will be and the bot, bot agent service will be invoked which will first download the packages that that has been used in uh, in your actions or in your workspace area. And then uh, once the uh, packages are downloaded, then it will start running the bot and perform the necessary action as desired or as expected. So it will take a few uh, minutes to uh, migrate the bot. So as you can see, the bot has run successfully and it has migrated uh, the bot from version 10 or sorry from version 11 to A360 format. And the output will be generated inside the folder 
that we have passed in the output folder. So this is the XML file which has been generated. So first we will open this using Notepad to see what all it, what all it contains. So it contains all the commands which have been used inside the uh, version 11 bot. So up till here, these are all the commands which has been used in version 11. And after this, uh, there is a variable uh, node uh, which contains all the variable names which has been used inside this uh, bot. So this is the overall summary of the report which gets generated. So this is how we can migrate the bot from version 11 to A360 format. Once the bot is migrated from the previous version to the latest version that is from version 10 or version 11 to A360 format to see the list of uh, to see the list of bots which have been migrated so click on this close button go to the automation tab and get see the name of your bot in the bot repository so once you find the bot click on it and you will see all the list of actions that are available in that particular uh, piece of bot so uh, the red triangle over here shows that there is some issue with the action or the command. So you have to rectify those issues and correct it. So this is how you can uh, use the bot migration feature using the uh, A2019 Automation Anywhere or Automation 360. So with that, we have come to the end of our video discussion, wherein we saw how to migrate the bots from one version to the uh, latest version of the bot, that is from version 10 or version 11 to automation 360 format. So I request you to, uh, so I request everyone of you to please watch the whole video till the end and please share your uh, reviews on, uh, and please share your reviews once you go through the video if you have any queries uh, you can post it in the comment section and i will be more than happy to answer all your queries so before we sign off for the day i request every one of you to please subscribe to my youtube channel and hit the notification icon so that you receive all the latest updates and notifications that we keep posting on our YouTube channel. Thank you all and have a great day.